Today in the Daily Mix Make Believe Kitchen is Cider Core, who has a sipping cider to support our veterans. Levi, how are you? Fantastic, yourself? So I'm very good. Let's also mention you're a former uh, Army guy. I am, yes, as well as our, our uh, owner is a Marine Corps veteran. That's where the Cider Core got its name from. That's awesome. And, and we got to mention they do get along. We got to make sure, you know, we do, different, yeah. different yeah. armed services there's, get along. There's some, but, there's some head butting <laughs> sometimes, but for the most part, yeah, we do get along Especially pretty well. Especially when it yeah. comes to the football season, kind of Army and Navy kind of go like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. we will get into that. So let's Let's talk, first of all, let's talk about cider because I, everybody knows cider like, you know, at, you know, Chris, at, um, you know, Halloween or different times in the fall, sipping that yep. kind of cider. But yeah. that really is just like, I mean, it's good cider. Right. But what you guys, I didn't understand is that cider is a lot different than what people think. It is. Yeah. So, I mean, it all starts with apples. Uh, apple juice is our base for everything. Um, we essentially ferment all the sugar out of it um, and then turns it into alcohol. And then from there, we add other fruit juices to then flavor it. Um, so there's no artificial uh, sugars, anything like that. So it is very... Um, it's a lot tastier than the typical cider you're gonna have. Yeah. yeah. So when you said that right there, so because the cider that you know you give the kids a sparkling cider yep. is non-alcoholic. Yep. This is actually a little bit of alcohol in there, right? A little bit, yeah, yeah. Anywhere from uh, usually they're around five and a half to seven percent, depending on uh, what cider it is. Yeah. So, yeah. And it's great right now to do some sipping with this because it's hot out. It is. You know, and maybe you don't want to have the heavy beer on you, and you want to exactly. have a nice, and maybe not the wine. You know, right. you got something right nicely. And, and I'm a cider guy, so but I'm like a little sparkling cider, so I'm lo I'm looking forward to tasting this. Yeah, here. yeah. I mean, it's light, uh, lightly carbonated as well, um, just like uh, beer would be, um, and we are delivering all throughout the valley. Um, um, as well as having takeaway options in our uh, spot as well. So. I love it. Okay, let's talk about some of the cans here because this is really, I mean, usually my cider comes in that little can with the apple on it and yeah. that's it. This is art here. What is going on here? Yeah, so uh, some of our, our newest cans that we have right now are um, in honor to some of our veterans. Um, so like the one on the very end right there is our Tropic Lightning. It's a strawberry and hibiscus. Um, that one is named after 25th Infantry Division out of Hawaii. Nice. Um, we have the Sailor Cherry over here, which is uh, kind of a homage to uh, Sailor Jerry um, is a, a famous um, veteran that uh, tattooed um, other veterans. Right. And then um, what's this one here? The the blue one. So that one's our fruit salad. That one is uh, it's it's kind of the moniker that we give to uh, all the ribbons on your chest. Uh, it's, they say because of all the colors, it looks like a fruit salad. Wow. Um, and then the sea bees, which uh, is not out yet, but will be coming out soon. Um, it's named after the the Navy sea bees, which are the construction uh, battalion for yeah. uh, the Navy. So, yeah. yeah. And what's really neat is that that those sea bees are very important because they go in and they build their own little camps and stuff before they have to do everything. Yeah. And so it's really cool. And then we have this. Is this a new one coming out too? Yeah. So this one's coming out as well. This one should be out uh, next week. Um, this is our blackberry camouflage. Uh, so it's our take on a mule with ginger and lime. Um, and then we added some blackberry on this time to, to kind of make it uh, fun and exciting. So, so yeah. All right. And one of these big cans. And then these big ones are uh, our bombs that we do every Friday, we come up with a different flavor, and then we have a limited amount that come in these um, these bombs, and uh, they sell out pretty quickly. They go online every Friday at noon, um, and you can find them on our website, cidercoreaz.com. And are there different are there different sleeves, or is it just the same color so bombs? So we, we don't did, collect them either. Uh, no, I mean uh, we did this one special one for uh, Purple Heart Day, which was um, last two weeks ago, I yeah. believe. Um, our owner is also a Purple Heart um, recipient, That's so great. we wanted to uh, you know, pay some, him some homage as well as uh, to the other Purple Heart recipients yeah. as well. So. That's awesome, yeah. and I know you have the regular cans down there, which is really neat. Yeah. You guys are located right in Mesa, right? In Mesa, now, right. Do you guys have a, a place people can come in and, and taste and stuff? Or? Yeah, we, so we normally do right now because of everything going on. We, our, our tap room is closed, uh, so we're just doing takeaway and uh, delivery, um, and then we also have Mike's Pizza inside that does really awesome pizza, and actually mm. if you come in on Saturdays, we give you 20% off of your cider order just for getting a pizza. So, I like that. You guys yeah. are supporting each other, yeah. which is really cool. It's great. So, okay, test time. Oh, Peace yeah. Time. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, uh, and this right here, what am I tasting here? So, this one is our uh, blueberry pie that we do for the summer. Okay. Um, it's uh, blueberry as well as uh, apple pie, apple juice is the base, of course, and then you have some pie spices, um, some vanilla, and there's even a little bit of that. You get that pie crust flavor oh in there. Oh, my yeah. God. Yeah. Oh, my God. It's very, it's very nice. Oh, very easy to drink. Oh, yeah, not too sweet, right? No, yeah, no. This was that is really good. Glad you like when it. When I asked you, told me that, but you also saying the rhubarb one is really good. Rhubarb right? is great. I mean, I really love tart. So you know, you you bite a piece of rhubarb and it tastes like almost like a Granny Smith apple. It's nice and yeah. tart. So. Yeah. Wow. I feel like, you know, I feel like I'm right now at Willy Wonka's. Okay, I, I taste blueberry. I taste the crust. 
Oh my goodness! <laughs> yeah. Wow! This, then let me start trying blue. No, just kidding. Yeah. So, we're wow. going to come up with a snozzberry flavor soon. Oh, we're still working on it, though. So. Are you? Oh my god, I just said, <laughs> I better put that down. Yesterday was margaritas. Yeah. You should have saw me at that day. That was, I was saying it's six and a half percent, so I mean, you, you're. You gotta uh, be careful. Yeah, you gotta be careful. Yeah, because sure, so. that's totally sipping that all day. Yeah. <laughs> Levi! Tell them the site that they can get their uh, cider. So cidercoreaz.com. Um, you can order for online or for takeaway. Uh, we do, I'm sorry, we can order for takeaway <laughs> or for delivery. Uh, we do deliver through uh, almost the entire valley. Um, I've been as far as uh, uh, Peoria and Glendale. So Okay. I, I'm going to go ahead and say, you got to get this. This is so good. I can't wait to taste the apple pie one. The apple pie so one's super good, too. We'll be doing some. I'm a peacock. I'm getting the fly. <laughs> Lynn, let me fly.